your original hometown dealer, Saida, Trudeau Chrysler, Jeep, Dodge, and Ram. <laughs> All right, here we go. Don't mess up. Oh. Uh -oh. oh. <laughs> there you go. With a new addition to Pahrump, the Veterans Memorial Advisory Committee, Knight County Commissioners Frank Carboni and Deborah Strickland, representatives from Pahrump Valley Fire and Rescue, Town Manager Tim Sutton, and many more welcomed the Veterans Memorial Building to town after years of planning. With many people's input, Double M Construction was able to build their new structure. This building cost $686,000 to build. The building includes a room for meeting, a waiting area, and bathrooms. This structure will now hold all of the Pahrump Veterans Memorial advisory meetings and all other advisory meetings in Pahrump. This new Veterans Memorial is located on East Street next to the Chief Tacopa Cemetery. We caught up with the Veterans Memorial Advisory Committee members Bruce Cox and Greg Cartarelli who talk about the process and what is in store for the future. Dr. Tom Waters also spoke about how happy he was for the building to venture into the future. The original building, was, it's got to be probably 40, 50 years old, and it was originally just a lean-to. And so then eventually we got to, to the point where they built a wall around that and it eventually became a building. Yeah, and, and then oh, I guess it was probably oh, probably oh three, oh four maybe, when a lot of people came out and they seen what shape the building was in, they seen what shape the burial grounds was in. And so it just progressed from there. A lot of people had uh, input with this building. And so we just thank the commissioners so much for what they did and the contractor and, and the committee itself. So I think the big thing is that we have the we have the restrooms. Yeah. Yeah. And this room here, we can use this room to we can have our Pahrump Valley advisory meetings here. So number one, we we needed uh, restrooms. That was our I think our number one thing yeah. because the building was here. It didn't have it didn't have plumbing at all, and it took them forever just to get fans into that building. So we wanted we wanted a building that could accommodate all the different committees here in town. Yeah. So yeah, so it's, it's just an absolutely beautiful building. There's a lot more to be done inside the building. They've got to uh, hook up IT, uh, that way we can get recorded meetings, we need monitors, things like that. So the town's gonna to work on, on getting all that started. You know, this is something we've been looking for for many years and to have it and see it Completed is just truly outstanding. This is a day to remember forever. The Veterans Memorial Advisory Board gave former Commissioner John Koenig a plaque for all he has done throughout the years for veterans and to facilitate the completion of the building, which still has some advancements coming in the near future. Thank you, everyone. I'm really glad to be here. This is amazing. Compared to what we had, this, well, you know, it's all down, so... <laughs> this kind of says it all. <laughs> These guys need something. They did what they were supposed to do, left their families and everything to serve our country. They deserve whatever we can give them.